All right, good morning, everybody. I want to say, uh, I guess, good morning to all the coffee drinkers, or uh, it, this may be the morning for you, or maybe evening time for you when you're watching this, but it's uh, afternoon on a Saturday morning. We just got through with a great conference call training, and this uh, is a video that I promise to give to each and every one of you for the purposes of being able to um, uh, uh, effectively invite for your launch conference calls and also for your co coffee and jazz mixers. Um, one of the things I want to go through real quick so that each and every one of you are really comfortable with the invite process is um, uh, there's three steps to a effective to an effective invitation. And the first step is making sure that you're in a hurry, be in a hurry. What I mean by being in a hurry is not that you're rushing. It's not that you are um, e evasive. It's just that you're not there to answer a lot of questions at this time. That's not the purpose of that call. The purpose of that call is to do exactly what you're doing, and that is to um, give a statement of, you know, to check interest. That's really what it is. So you're, you're in a hurry. The second thing is to show value. You got to remember that everybody is tuned into their favorite radio station, and it's called WIIFM. What's in it for me? So people don't care about all the other details. They only want to know what's in it for me, and you have to get right to that. So show value. And the third thing is you must take it away whenever necessary. How do you take it away? How do you show value? Uh, let me go ahead and give you a couple of examples of that. What I'm going to give you now is not necessarily what I call a script. It's just something that uh, of the mindset that I had when I was making invitations or making invite calls to the people that um, that were on my list, and uh, it went something like this. So I pick up the phone. Hello, I speak to CC, and CC would say, "Hey, Al Holton, how are you?" And I say, "Hey, CC, how are you?" And uh, she said, I'm doing fine. And, and my reply would be, hey, Cece, listen, the, the purpose of, of my call is I wanted to update you on what's recently taken place. Well, what are you talking about, Holt? Well, listen, I just partnered up with some people. We're the first to bring a concept of healthy coffee to North America. What we've done, Cece, this organization and this team that I'm a part of, we've actually designed a system to capture 1% of the coffee industry over the next three years. Now, the agreements that we've put together uh, is a 50-50 split, but 1% represents $125 million a month in coffee sales. That's going to go through our organization. And with that 50-50 split, that's $62.5 million that's going to be paid back to us from the manufacturer. Uh, so my friends, myself, and a few other executives will be splitting that type of revenue on a monthly basis. Based off of what I've said to you so far, would you want to get more information on this coffee, the opportunity, or both? Okay, both. Great. Well, 7 o'clock on Monday, we're going to have a mixer, a coffee mixer. Uh, there's going to be a few executives there, a few of my other associates. That's going to be there. Probably some people that you know of. But um, 7 o'clock, can you go ahead and prioritize Monday at 7 o'clock? and be there on time great okay well all the information is going to be covered there you'll be able to uh, sample the coffee but you'll see more importantly the business plan of how we're going to do this but I think you'll like what you see great I'll see you there at 7 now so you see if you can't make it for some reason I only have limited seats for this this is a private engagement <clears throat> please call me and let me know because I like to at least replace you with somebody else who could be there Okay? All right, I'll see you then at 7. Bye. So that is the invitation call. It's real simple. Uh, it's easy. It's coffee, as we say in this business. It's easy, as simple as coffee. So don't get into a whole lot of questions. Uh, one other invite that I've used before is um, I've called people up, and, and these are what I call my USPs, my unique sales propositions. Call up a friend. You know, hey, Cece, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing fine. Cece, let me ask you a question. If I found a way to make a fortune on the internet in the next six to 12 months, would you want to know about it? And CC says, well, what is it? Listen, I can't explain all the details, but I'm hosting a conference call. I've got a very successful uh, friend of mine uh, who's 36 years old, he's a multimillionaire. I would like for you to meet him. He's a very interesting person. 
has a lot to offer in a conversation. We're going to have a private conference call 7 o'clock on Monday. Um, could you prioritize that time and clear your calendar and be on that call at that time? You'll try. Listen, right now, you know, I understand that, but I'm not necessarily looking for effort. I need a firm yes or no because I've got about 50 people who want to join that call but I only have 10 slots available. So can you be on there or can you not? That way I can make adjustments, remove you, and then put somebody else in that place. Okay, so you'll make it? Okay, sounds good. Okay, I'll see you on that call. This is the number, 218-862-1300. The PIN number is 246857. I'll see you on that call. Get on early to ensure your spot on there, okay? Now remember, if something ever happens where you can't get on there, please call me because I don't want to have any wasted space. I'd like to at least replace you with somebody who can be on. I'll talk with you later. All right, bye. That's another invite. So basically, I'm doing the same thing. I'm in a hurry. Uh, I'm showing value. Uh, I showed value by asking them if I found a way to make a fortune on the Internet and make six to 12 months what they want to know about it. And, um, and I'm taking it away if, if, if I need to. It means that I'm letting them know I, I don't necessarily need them. I want them to be on, but I don't need them to be on that conference call. Um, another call. Let me just give you another example. Hello, my speak to CC. Hey, Cece, how are you? Oh, I'm doing fantastic. It's Holton. Good, good, good. Well, listen, I, I was calling you. Uh, there's some major things that have taken place uh, recently. I know we haven't had a chance to catch up up to speed, but I got a real quick question for you. If there was an opportunity for you to have joined Starbucks 10 years ago and become one of their partners, would you have taken advantage of it? Are you sure about that? <laughs> Listen, well, obviously that opportunity is gone. There is a new opportunity in the coffee industry, in the healthier coffee industry, that is actually done in six months what it took Starbucks two years to do. I'm one of the first to be able to get involved. I wanted to at least extend an opportunity for you to see a plan and meet some of my friends who are involved as well. Well, we're going to explain all the details at a mixer. We're going to have what we call a coffee and jazz mixer. It's going to be at my house Tuesday at 7 o'clock. I want you to be here. I mean, can you prioritize your time, that time, to be here at 7 o'clock? Okay, great. What we're going to do is this here. We'll sample some of the coffee. We'll go over the business model. And if you qualify to work with us, then we'll take it from there. Okay? Well, what I mean by that is this. Everybody... Uh, obviously, we're not looking for any and everybody, but, uh, you know, I called you for a specific reason. You always seem to be pretty sharp and, and uh, level-headed, so uh, just come on over. There's no pressure on me. There's no pressure on you, but I want you to at least meet some of these other people. They're pretty interesting people, very, very successful, okay? Okay, now listen, if you can't make it, I need you to call me because I've got a lot of people who uh, would be interested, but uh, I only have a few slots for this particular session here, okay? And I'd like to at least replace you if you couldn't make it. All right, I'll talk with you later. Bye-bye. Now, as you guys see, that uh, the invitation process is, is real simple. I, I, keep, I follow the same formula. I'm in a hurry. I show value. I take it away every single time, and uh, you should do the same thing. So with that, uh, hopefully this is going to help you with your, with your invite and uh, with the invitation process of, of how to get people. But remember, don't stay on the phone trying to answer questions. Then when they ask you questions, uh, simply say, hey, listen, you know what? Uh, all those details is going to be covered by one of our top executives on this conference call. All the details will be covered at the meeting. Uh, why don't you just come? Listen, there's no pressure on you. There's no pressure on me. As a matter of fact, there's a chance that you may not even qualify to work with this team. So let's just go ahead and keep first things first and at least get you exposed, taking it away even more. Got to be polite with it, but be stern, be firm, and mean what you say and say what you mean. So with that, um, remember, it's easy, simple as coffee. Each and every one of you have a coffee-licious day. And we'll see you at the meeting. Goodbye, everybody.